they wore was wool and linen. And you, you might think it's, it's pretty hot, but actually it's, it's fairly cool because it breathes. And when it's wet, it keeps you warm. What the men are wearing are basically shell jackets, which was an issue uh, item throughout Columbus, Augusta, Richmond. We all uh, were issued for them arsenals. A lot of them you see wearing light blue pants. Uh, we wore light blue trousers, which usually we, we got from federal soldiers after battle because the southern depots couldn't keep up with the demand and the war, you know, we was, our supply was running short, so we'd have to take from the enemy. So the Confederate soldier kind of used a wide variety of clothing, and his, and his uniforms were not always as uniform as what the National Army was. We have uh, Yankee uh, forage caps, which this man's wearing right here. Uh, they take hats, but most, most of the men wore slouch hats, civilian, civilian slouch hats, because uh, they shaded you better and it, it was more feasible for uh, the weather and the, and the terrain, especially to keep the